Hey guys, so here's the law of cosines. Once again, in any triangle, it doesn't have to be a right triangle. You have the sides, the A, the B, the C, are the little letters, and then the capital A, capital B, capital C are the angles, and those are the larger letters. And notice how the C is always opposite that C, the B is always opposite the B, the A is always opposite the A. So the way this formula works is uh, you plug all these things in for either C, A, or B, Notice that this C matches this C, this A matches this A, and this B matches this B, and then the other letters are on the inside. So really, you technically only need one of these formulas. As long as you know, you can shift and change any one of the letters to be it. But that's the law of cosines. If you want to see me use it, uh, I will do that in a problem in a second. So I hope this helped, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.